Ladies and gentlemen, the American jury and Bulldog Nation, this past weekend on Saturday, Dr. Charles Washam, a psychiatrist, psychologist, sent to me a 30-minute video that he wanted me to watch, and he said, I want you to watch this and give me your comments about it. And what it was, was one of the producers of Hunger Games series, as well as others, actually did a 30-minute video about the pedophile situation in Hollywood. Now, we've all seen some actors come forward. We've heard about the Me Too movement, Harvey Weinstein, Epstein, Bill Cosby. Of course, he, he stuck with adults. But ladies and gentlemen, the American jury and Bulldog Nation, I want you to ask yourself this question. Based upon Harvey Weinstein, based upon Epstein, based upon, uh, it was I think it was Corey, not Corey Ham, it was the other Corey, um, the actor that said that there was some sick stuff going on. I gotta ask you this question, ladies and gentlemen, the American jury and Bulldog Nation. Do you believe that there is in Hollywood some sick stuff going on as it relates to pedophilia. And when I mean pedophilia, I'm talking about underage girls and boys. Underage girls and boys. The answer is an obvious yes. And it's not just Hollywood. I think that this country, and let's face it, folks, why is there child porn on the internet? How, how can that ever be? And every day, you and I see where there's arrests about human trafficking, child pornography, so forth and so on. There is an underbelly culture. Remember, I tell you all the time, there's subcultures. There's a sports subculture. There's an academic subculture. There's music. There's all kinds of subcultures. The militia. I mean, there's all kinds. There's hundreds of thousands of them. There is a sick subculture in this country as it relates to underage boys and girls and rich and powerful people that abuse them. Now, here was the thrust of this video. The thrust of the video, what this guy was saying is, not only is this prevalent, and they actually did a movie that Amazon shut down. They did a movie about it. Amazon shut it down. And the thrust of this video was, is the mainstream media, CNN, CBS, let's face it, we have the stories that we know about Weinstein and Epstein that got shut down. Now, ladies and gentlemen, the American jury and Bulldog Nation, how is it and why is it that major news networks and not only major news networks, but social media platforms protect this story from getting out there. There's only one logical explanation. Those people engaged in this sick stuff have power and influence inside those studios, inside those platforms. So you're, I can't make the punchline up. You ready for the drum roll? And I don't want a drum roll. It's a figurative speech. I don't want a drum roll. This is the punchline of this. I watch, now folks, I don't watch too many 30-minute videos. I watched this 30-minute video. Told Dr. Washam how sick it was. You know what I did? I immediately posted it on our platforms with a comment that, hey, this needs to be watched. Everybody needs to be aware of this. You can't make this up. YouTube took it down. I had a Facebook friend said, hey, did you know that YouTube took that video that you put? All I did was repost the video. Think about that. What the hell? You got a famous person in Hollywood talking about the pedophilia problem and how the media and the platforms protect it. I just posted and it gets taken down. 
Ladies and gentlemen, the American Jury and Bulldog Nation, I think, I see myself, just so you know, I see myself as the average Joe American male, heterosexual American male. I do. The way I think, the way I, I just think the average Joes think like me, see things like I do. And you know what we are? We're sinners, we're not saints. You all know all of our foibles, all the things that we do. But let me just tell you something. We all recognize that sex is sex between two consenting adults. Knock yourself out. But we also recognize that this is some sick, sick stuff. It's not sex. It is power, it's control, it's criminal, it's deviant, it's life destroying. And there needs to be a wake up call about it. Human trafficking, child pornography, pedophilia. We need to all speak out about it. And we all need to ask some tough questions. And I'm telling you right now, I'm, I, I just know. This goes deep. I've had enough conversations with some people that I know that locally, regionally, it's a problem. Not just in Hollywood. It's sick. And we should not accept it. This is the bulldog. Every dog has their day. Let's protect our children.